Okay, guys. This one is also stamp, and you have one, two, three, four quotes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ouch, did I include the fish? Sorry. Oh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four quotes, and then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stamps, and two, three dies. Cute, right? And that's what that looks like in the back. Put that there. Is this a magazine for that one? I don't think that is good. Hold up. Let me just get this shit out of here. Sorry, guys. Pardon my French, por favor. My leg is like... <laughs> you know when you shock somebody with that regulator, whatever that shit is called? Um, let's see here. These are very cute. This one is Simply Cards and Paper Craft, issue 162. And again, you get... Am I right? What did I? What did you get free with this one? I'm kind of mixed up. Did this come with this? Who cares? I don't. Anyway, as long as I, I got it, that's all I know. And a lot of inspirational in here as well. Look at these cute dies that they're sharing there. And how they're making these flowers, putting them together. What I love is the mermaid. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, love that. So, built a bouquet. Outline dies and stamp set. You know what's funny, guys? I have, I sometimes purchase kits that do come with the die and the stamp, but I'm always fuzzy cutting. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. This one's very nice. This is, an, this is an issue 165, June 2017 also. And I think this one's the one that came with, uh, yeah. I just don't like these pages. I don't use them. Quite honestly, I just leave them there because they're like, I feel if they get wet, these stuff that they have here, look at those dies. See those little ballerina shoes, the teddy bear, the tutu, and the bodysuit there. So cute. This card is so gorgeous. Look at that. So, there you go. This is the one that came with the Enchanted. Learn fab new techniques where it are tip experts. Awesome. Look at how nice. Isn't that cute for a beat? My, I know my grandson would love a card like that. So, I am going to bite off of this one. Why does my phone keep on beeping? Oh, I wanted to share with you guys. Oh my God, they have such cute cards in here. Um, I was watching... This down. I think I'm done with my magazines, yeah. I was watching Happily Ella After, and I don't know. Um, I know my niece was the one who told me about this. I got to put my foot down, and I hope I don't get Um, I picked up a whole bunch of these. Well, only the ones that I don't have. But, which was a lot of them. <laughs> um, I, I never bothered, like, with the dabbers. I have a few. I just picked, like, the colors. I used to buy them from Joann's for $2.49. So, for $1.49, seriously, why not? I had a whole bag full of them. I even picked up the distress paper, but I don't know where I put it. Um, let's see here. Okay. Craft tab. There's a craft tab. That one, I got craft inventory. That, um, it's... If you have an iPhone, I think it's also for Android phones. The phones, phones. I at all. Dios mío, I don't think you could see it, but let's see here. Anyway, let me just show you what it looks like. That's my craft app where I can actually I take a photo of um, the SKU number of the items and with craft inventory. Let's see here. The list. Uh, I don't have anything there. So it has like a category. This app is $2.99, I believe. I don't know if it went up because I have this for a while. But it, it lists, you can see everything in there. Books, magazine, adhesive, embellishment, ink pads. I don't know what that says right there because I can't see this way. So that's that one app. And then you have the Tim Holtz app, which is free, Android or Apple. 
Um, and that's what the Tim Holtz app looks like. So here is, um, usually if I want to see what he has out there that's new, I'll just go to products. And then it's going to give me the list of whatever he has. Uh, Ranger, ideology, alterations, uh, collection, stamp is anonymous, electric elements, and uh, tonic studios. Everything is listed there. So, um, you go to that one there, which is, which, which one? If I go to um, alterations, I'm going to get, oops, sorry guys. Alterations, I'm going to get the list of what's there. And I want to buy a strip die. I don't know if I have it. All the strip dies are listed there. The ones that are checked off in green, I have. The ones that are not, I don't have. So that's an easy way to buy your Tim Holtz product. Tim Holtz, these are Ranger items. I can just go back in. There's even punches listed, guys. I'll just click my Ranger. I know the glare is bad, guys. So sorry. And here is the list of whatever there is out there, including distressed crayons. You name it, it's in here, guys. Everything that's Ranger. So distress paint dabbers. Distress stain. These are stains. So they have distress paint flip tops, distress stains, and you just click on your distress stains. All the ones that I have are listed, and the ones I don't have are not listed. And I know I've purchased a few of them that I have not listed. So that's why I'm rearranging my stuff in here so that I can go in there and check off what I have. So that's how that app works. Again, is a Tim Holtz app. You can Google it. It comes up. Um, Tim Holtz product app, whatever it's called. I just have it there. And that's how I keep track of all my dyes, all my Tim Holtz stuff. It'd be nice if they had free apps for every single brand name out there. Oh, my phone would be loaded. But anyway, again, on this type of stuff, I can just scan the barcode. I'm going to see if I, I haven't used that one. I haven't done it in a while. Usually when I have that, I pull my stuff out of my room, that I start going through everything. I don't do it with the embellishment because it's just like the dyes and stuff that you don't need two of the same dyes. You could use two of the same embellishments, but not dies or punches. Everything is listed here, guys. So you can either new item, just, oh, yeah, yeah. Can you guys, I hope you guys can see that. I'm sorry for the glare. It's the only way I can do it. Tag, type, color, and company. Or you can go to more and you see how you have, um, what's that total gallery scanner I'm gonna hit the scanner and it's okay the camera and then I'm just gonna flip you're not gonna use a Tuesday morning barcode you're gonna use the barcode on the product itself so press OK and it's gonna scan it for me no match it tells you no match you see and then it's gonna ask you to add item I'm gonna add the item and I would call this embellishment. Again, these kind of stuff I do not put in here, but I can just go in here and it's got the barcode. Sometimes usually the barcode comes up with the name back. Oh, what, what, where did it go? Embellishments. And hmm, I don't know. Who's this by Canvas? Home Basic. Acme, Ajax, Dunder, Mifflin, Grot, Megacorp. Ew, Acme? Where is this from? Anyway, guys, I'm not going to waste my time with this because, again, I don't put this kind of stuff in here. I just put my stuff. My Actually, I'm going to list my Martha Stewart punches in here, but that's how it's done. This ad is called... Um, ay, ay, ay. Let's see. Craft with a K inventory. Let's see here if I can wind in. Mm -hmm. no. Craft in Inventory with a K. K R A F T S Inventory. $2.99 the app. And the Tim Holtz, guys, is free. I love my T Tim Hans Tim Holtz app. You can view his blogs, his videos, calendar, events, 
inventory product wish list. I don't bother with that. There's even Pinterest and Twitter, Facebook. I also saw um, Dawn Dare to be Creative. Hi, honey. She was mentioning how she puts her stuff in Pinterest. So there you go. That's another idea. But my Tim Holtz, it's on my phone. And I love that. I love that app. So I did go um, Tuesday morning and just a few of the stuff that I picked up. This is Jolie Boutique. Oh no, this is Martha Stewart. What am I talking about? I found this one particular glitter distress pink raspberry. I didn't even bother to check if I have it. I love glitter. So I don't need it, but I love it. <laughs> and a whole bunch of stain, guys. I actually found like seriously again spice marmalade. I picked up all of these for $1.49. Heck, why not? Mustard seed, but just keep in mind, like I tell myself all the time, I didn't. Okay, these are all with their plastic wrapping. Yeah, I made sure just to get the ones with the plastic wrapping. I got some liquid pearls. You guys have seen these. Was this $2.99? No. Yes, it was. It's still good anyway. It's like $5.99. If not more at Michael's. 1825915. And Ranger. Seriously, I love Ranger. I'm so bummed out waiting for them to have the Ranger warehouse. If they don't have it this year, it's gonna be the third year. And I so miss them. It's always fun to make crafters and all the stuff that goes on over there. Um this applicator for $1.99, and there is a SKU number. Some more stain. This is ice bruised. Oh, this was given to me by my crafty friend. She included this in a bag for Mother's Day. Isn't this cute? It's pink and it holds a glue gun. And she finds all this cool stuff at the $1 store in Bayonne, guys. So if you're in New Jersey, that's where you're going to find it. Downtown Abbey. I know that I have some stuff that I purchased from HSN. I don't know if this is one of them that was included, quite honestly, because I don't remember what I purchased. But this is like a card, um, blank, uh, card blank pad. There it goes. Blah, blah, blah. And this was the only one that they had. It was open. I just made sure nothing was missing. These are so pretty. I just love like the colors in there. They're so nice. The styles are so vintagey. So I got that. Oh, and I picked up this paper pad, 1813880. This here, the SKU number, 1812538. Again, 1812538. Hope you guys can see that. And then here is the other one. This one's called what? Harmony, 6x6. Six six. I'm pretty sure I have this one. I might not have too much of it left because I think I use this particular ones for tags. I remember using that dress form kind of thing. See that? So awesome. Um, some more of the stains. We probably use these instead of using my ink pads. But this one is squeezed lemonade. And again, I know that I have a few of these. Some of them were listed. I'm pretty sure I haven't listed them all. I listed these, though. Um, pink ra uh, raspberry. Picked, not pink. This one is candy apple. They have a whole bunch of them. Fossilized amber. And actually, if I go back, there's a few more that... Wild honey, once I finish listing them, to make sure... Oh, and I found some zing embossing powder. Look at that color. Awesome. So I got that. I love to use that with black. It looks so cute. Um, I actually, did I get it? I, I have it in my cart. I haven't ordered it, <laughs> which I'm going to do in a few. Um, the little green monster to emboss that on a black card. I think that would be so cute. All right, guys, I'm going to stop this video here because as always, I'm only doing 15 minutes. Hopefully I can do better when I invert my system here, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. See you. Bye.